Okay, back at it. Oh, yeah, I know. It's important shit. We, you know, that's firing this thing up. It's going to be some, <laughs> it's going to take a little bit to get the instructions out here, okay? So, I uh, got to keep at it. Um, now, next step is um, figuring out how much spark and what kind of spark are we sending, to, uh, you know, on TV. Because, uh, you know, there's such a thing as too damn much spark. <laughs> And then there's not enough, okay? That's the one we don't want to have happen because you can't get it fired without enough spark. So, you know, this is where, uh, you know, y'all in Avatar uh, Federation, dude, you're up to bat. <laughs> <laughs> you are the damn spark plug. Dude, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you are... Uh, a very advanced level of spark plug. And you're going to be delivering spark. All right. And uh, we got to have a good glow because, uh, you know, there's not much fuel out there to run on right now. And uh, so uh, we're going to have to make sure that's a great spark. And uh, we're going to do it by giving them the piece of what's going down. And we're going to do it by, I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll start with you boys at the top, all right? Because I'm just going to give you an example of what we're talking about here. Is the hope and the peace of what's coming, you know, the, uh, the overall, how we're going to uh, make a beautiful running engine here. And, uh, you know, y'all's first meeting is going to be kind of important because... First of all, we're going to figure out how many damn parts of the engine there actually is to this thing. Um, I will be discussing that with you just beforehand, but uh, you guys get to break the news, okay? Because, uh, yeah, uh, Luxembourg can't be an engine all by itself, dude. Come on, man. They, they, they're just not enough there to do with, you know? Talk about an unbalanced engine. No, we got to have an engine that runs smoothly. And uh, you can't have one piston that's the size of a pea drop and the other one is the size of a freaking tank. Yeah, that's not going to run a very smooth. We're always going to be dealing with that PN. Anyway, uh, so we're going we're gonna to make them pistons the same size. That's the best way to make this thing run smooth. I, you know, any engineer will tell you, you don't put different size pistons in there. I mean, we can have a little bit of difference. It's going to be all right. But uh, no, no, Luxembourg to Russia. No, that's some big angle run with shit. <laughs> Sorry, folks. Uh, it's an engineering thing, okay? Uh, everyone else, you know, just let them do it, okay? So, now... Once you get out there and you give them that information, you don't even do that again tomorrow. So uh, the best part about that is that one's done. That one's uh, that one's got to be, uh, and you know that's the one that uh, the spark's going to be a little hard to accept on some of them, uh, realizing that they are now a state instead of a country, and uh, they're just another cog in the wheel. You know, you got to get it to them that uh, we're all cogs in the wheel. You know, just because you boys are the timing chain doesn't make you any more important than any other part of this motor, all right? And that they are any less, okay? And so, uh, you know, I think he picked you guys because you know what the hell you're, you know, in front of the camera how to handle this. So I'm not going to get much more details into it. I just want to, you know, give you that uh, heads up that uh, we're about Spark. Because, uh, you know, bright boys, bright times. Let's see you shine. That's what uh, we want to know. And uh, all the way down to the, the state, you know, on TV. We want uh, positive hope and uh, straightening everything out right off the get-go to uh, let everyone know who and what and where is uh, God's government. So it's going to be a long show. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we're going to have to uh, make it all day or I don't know. I don't know. It's, uh, you know, 
it's uh and some of y'all you might want to try to plan a speech or you want to just have uh okay here's the agenda let me let me just go i hope y'all don't mind we're just going to free will this speech thing because uh no we, we got to go through the instructions <laughs> and that'll be fine all right because like i said there are some states that are no friggin way anywhere near states like iowa okay uh so it's gonna be um a very different speech on the state level for each of those and so uh but that doesn't mean that there isn't some power that can come out of Iowa and there isn't some power that can happen out of those other states. Okay. And by the way, just so y'all know that Iowa is an awesome state, but she has a sister state, uh, Illinois. Um, see those two, they kind of are the border of the holy city, the holy village. And uh, we're going to show Iowa is going to, to uh, show Illinois what a sister can really be. And uh, hand in hand, we're going to be like the, uh, the group that everybody looks at. Okay. We kind of have an unbalanced uh, firing order from one to the other right now. But uh, that's going to change. Um, it's uh, it's not a secret that uh, Illinois' uh, development in infrastructure has been slacking. And it's usually, and it has been because of uh, Chicago. What it brings in and what it costs is uh, choked the state many times over. The balance of that state is going to be fixed. Um, there's a lot of bad things in Chicago. Um, it's uh, it's the exact opposite of uh, Muscatine. And so we may think that we got it perfect here, but let me tell you, right next door, we have one of the most hurting cities in the world. And uh, so uh, we're going to be setting that example. And that's why my first trip is going to be to Chicago. Because I'm sorry, my sister state, she's got to, she's got to know. She's got to have that help. And uh, I'm, uh, I'm actually looking forward to it. Um, so, I mean, we're all one anyway, guys. It's just these two are uh, really close to me, literally. <laughs> so uh, we're uh, we'll be making that very first trip, and then it'll be to the world leaders, and where they want me to land, I'll go to each one of them, and uh, that's just the basic itinerary and uh, firing order and firing instructions. And, uh, yeah, dude, make sure I got a plane with new wheels, dude. I'm telling you, I, I'm going to be up and down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's going to be one of those things. Uh, she's going to get some mileage on her. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, uh, that's, uh, that's, that's as far as we got right now. And, uh, I need to do breakfast and uh, um, let y'all think about that a little bit. And uh, it, it's, I'm telling you, dude, I have started many of engines. It never freaking runs right in the beginning. It never. But you, little love, a little care, a little oil. <laughs> and you got to have fuel. We got to have fuel. Okay. Make sure there's damn fuel on board. Okay. <laughs> You cannot get fire without fuel, okay? All right. Anyway, I'm going to go put some fuel in my tank. <coughs> and uh, and be back at you here in a few, okay? I'll talk at you here in a few.